Hey YouTube, I'm just looking for a little help here. Hopefully uh, somebody has, out there has the answer for this problem I'm having. I know OnePlus doesn't think NFC is important, but I kind of do. I think it's awesome to be able to take a phone, and this is the OnePlus One, and just be able to pair it by just touching your device. Um, this uh, OnePlus One can do it. This 2014 Moto X. So each one's giving me the prompt. These are two different two different devices. Oops. Two different uh, devices, two different manufacturers, but they both work perfectly. Now with the Asus Zenfone 2, this is where I'm having the problem. It'd help if I unlocked it. Nothing. It will not give me a prompt to pair. No matter what I do. I've tried everything I can think of. NFC's on, Wi-Fi's on, everything's on. So, um, I'm just curious if anybody out there has the answer to why I cannot pair anything to this Asus Zen phone. Overall, it's an awesome phone. Uh, the only shortcomings is uh, viewing angles are a little less uh, than some of the others. But uh, overall, I like it better than I like the OnePlus One. I think it takes a better picture. And the uh, customization of the... Uh, Operating system is, is phenomenal. I mean, for the price of this phone, I think it's the best thing going on the market for an unlocked phone. But that NFC issue is important to me, and uh, that's that's a big problem that I can't get it to work. Asus, uh, it's well documented on Asus, Asus's forum, and they just haven't done anything about it. That's the reason why I'm making this video. As far as the OnePlus 2 goes, I will not be buying it uh, because it does not have M NFC, and that's an important thing to me. Also, uh, if mobile payments ever takes off, you're not going to be able to use it with the OnePlus 2 like you, like you can even with the OnePlus 1. Uh, this is a great phone too, but I, I think I like the Asus just a little bit better. Um, if anybody has the answer to uh, my NFC pairing problem, I'd greatly appreciate hearing from you. Thank you. Hey, this is just a quick update. I finally got things straightened out. Um, this is in addition to my previous video. I'm hoping I can just add it into the first one. But after three trips to uh, Asus, and they finally replaced my phone, I finally get the dialog box to come up to actually pair to, uh, oh great, this won't focus. I finally get the dialog box to pair with uh, NFC. Once again, my previous phone had everything on, Bluetooth, NFC, Wi-Fi, everything. Uh, so the one guy that commented, oh, there's NFC in the menu. Yeah, genius, I know that. Um, but it wasn't working with that. I sent it back. They sent it back to me, and uh, it was still doing the same thing. It was making the sound and not connecting. Um, sent it back again. They sent it back. It didn't. It didn't work there either. It wouldn't even make the sound anymore like it wanted to pair. And um, finally, I, once I had it back there for that, I, I said, "Listen, you guys got to send me a new one. This is getting ridiculous." And the new one works perfectly. All right, so I know a few of you have responded saying you did have a problem, so evidently there is some sort of issue, but um, it's not inherent to the unit. Uh, unit. It's not a software issue, so if, if your NFC is not working, uh, get it fixed or get it replaced, whatever, but it is supposed to work. All right, thanks for looking. Bye.